Hey guys, I'm back with a new video and today's video is actually going to be a first impression video on the new Maybelline Superstay Better Skin and it's a skin transforming foundation. So it is said to say that in this, with this foundation if you apply it for a few days your skin will improve and get better. Um, I have obviously not tried it. It's my very first time that I'm going to be applying it today. That's probably why you're wondering why are you looking so pale today. Um, I want to pl apply it um, and give you guys my first my first impression and see how I like it, how it feels. Now, I love when new foundations come out because I love to try out uh, new products because, like you guys already know, and I'm always mentioning that I have oily skin. So I like to find new products that suit my skin very well, especially, especially if they are drugstore products because they are so affordable and they will work just as well. So when I found out they had this new foundation, especially Maybelline, because I love Maybelline products, um, I had to get my hands on it and do a first impression review uh, video for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. I know it's been a while since I've done a first impression. So let's get started and apply this new bad boy on my face. Um, it does say that it has SPF. It has SPF 15 and it is, it has Actyl C. I'm not too sure what that is. But it, it, it is oil free so that again it's already a plus. And I got it in the shade Nude Beige. It's number 25 in case you guys are wondering. So I have my beauty blender, I have the Real Techniques beauty blender and I already moisturized my face with the Green Tea Moisturizer by Proactive. Um, I love how this moisturizer has been working for me and my skin so it's what I've been using to moisturize my face and I'm gonna damp my beauty blender with the uh, Derma E Hydrating Mist and this is to just refresh your skin and hydrate it and also to promote younger looking skin but I'm like, hello. Um, I'm just kidding with you guys. Um, and this is for dry, normal, oily skin. Um, I usually just do it to keep my, my face for these days. It's been scorching hot here in LA. It's horrible, you guys. I'm like melting already. But it's been like super hot. So I use this to hydrate my skin and keep it hydrated. So I'm going to just damp my moisturizer a bit. Just so it can be a little moisturized. And I'm going to go ahead and apply... And the foundation, I love that it has a little pump already because i rather just pump my foundation on it as opposed to putting it on my hand. So I'm going to pump the foundation out. So just a little dab and I'm going to start applying it to my face. So I'm already liking the way it's applying. Look at how that is being applied. Ooh. And it's not too heavy. I can already feel that it's not very heavy. It feels very lightweight on my skin. Which, that's a plus. Because I don't like to feel all cakey with my makeup. Got more. think I already liking it it feels really good it doesn't feel cakey at all it's like setting on my skin perfectly right now so it feels like it's gonna be kind of like it's gonna mattify which is always great because I don't like to feel like kind of sticky and like oily especially because of my face so that is a plus and the coverage is good it's like a medium coverage it's not like super high but it's a medium coverage so I do like that um, it does cover all the imperfections on my blemishes, which is great. So, it is, let's see, I was charging my phone. I don't know if you guys can see my time, but it is, can you guys see? My time is like, it's 201. Okay, so I already did my makeup. I did very minimal, simple. This is my everyday go-to 
makeup look it's very simple but yet you know you look radiant and you look great so i'm gonna film a makeup tutorial i haven't done a tutorial for you guys in so long but um yeah i did my makeup and i love the way the foundation is setting so far it's great with my setting powder and all the makeup that i put on uh it's not dewy it did not leave a dewy finish which i love because oily and dewy just is not a great combo especially not right now in this heat so i really love that it's mattifying it's set on my skin really quickly it's not creasing yet it's not like uh setting on my my little wrinkles um it's definitely great i'm i mean i'm loving it i'm loving it so far i just applied it so we're gonna see how it lasts throughout the whole throughout the rest of the day so i will check back in with you guys later throughout the day to see how this foundation lasts so hopefully this foundation lasts a good few hours and i ended up i ended up falling in love with it because so far i love it but i'm um, again i need to wait and see how it goes on throughout my day so i'm gonna get going go on about my day and then i'll check it back in with you guys later i will see you guys in a few hours bye guys hey guys i'm back um so it is now 8.01 p.m. It has now been six hours since the time that I applied my makeup and I put on the foundation and I can honestly say that I still am loving it. As you can tell, I went out about my day. I was out and about and it was super hot today. It looks awesome. It stayed, as you can tell, I'm not really oily. Um, it stayed pretty mattified throughout my entire day. It did not crease. It did not sit anywhere. Um... I just love it and it's not cakey at all it's really like mattifying I really do like it I don't know if your skin will improve within a few days because this is my first time trying it but I can honestly say that I would definitely be trying it out again um, so I definitely do recommend you guys trying it out I really do like it it did last me a while so hopefully you guys enjoy this video again this was for the Maybelline Superstay Better Skin Foundation excuse me um it's about like ten dollars at target i got at target so it's like ten dollar drugstore price it's pretty affordable and it's drugstore and it works wonders i loved it um medium coverage uh it pretty much did a good job covering you know blemishes and perfections dark circles i'm not really even wearing concealer today guys and look at how good it is I mean, it's totally worth it. So I highly do recommend you guys going out and trying it. It is oil-free, so if you have oily skin, it's going to work. It should work really good for you. And if you guys did try it out already um, or you want to try it out, leave me a comment below and let me know how it is working for you or how it has been working for you. If you've seen that your skin does improve within a few days, let me know. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, give my video a thumbs up if you guys did enjoy or found this useful. Um, and don't forget to follow my fashion blog at fashionistinthecity.blogspot.com, which I need to get back to again. Oh my god, you guys, like, don't forget to follow me also on Instagram at fashionistinthecity underscore and Twitter at ashley underscore 24. So thank you guys very much for watching. If you're not subscribed to my channel, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.